Hello everyone, this is Mad Cat Spear, and I just need to upload this video talking about uh, how we perceive psychonesis and how we need to transform how we perceive it and how we uh, associate um, how we go about developing it and how we feel toward it. And and and, and the thing is though is that uh, we get a lot of false information and a lot of bad stigma. Um, from television and comic books and from uh, cartoons and we think that you know since we see Goku fighting everybody and using his psychokinetic powers and whatnot that that's like what we need to be we need to be kind of like you know very aggressive and very angry and and be you know like you know psychonesis realistically we have to see it as it is and psychonesis is a learning tool for the living you know, for, uh, it, it's it's a spiritual tool for the living to develop their knowledge and, and to understand themselves. And um, psychonesis is not something that should be within the realm of aggression or anger or, or ego or showing off. Like how we see in comic books, like with these telekinetics and these powerful wizards and these movies and on... And, and, and they're always fighting and they're always, you know, they, it's so easy for them and they just have a lot of negative things. And so psychonesis can be, should be thought of as a person learning how to play chess, a person learning how to um, do math equations on a paper, you know. It's something that's just calm and relaxed and you're just by yourself learning the, the, the skill for yourself. You're alone. You know, and and it's just a mundane, relaxed thing that doesn't have any aggression or any violence happening around. Psychonesis is a learning thing. It's like a like an educational thing. It, it's something that that makes you grow, and it should be thought of as something more patient and more uh more um um I'm internal developing. Like with chess, like I said, chess. Like when you play against other people, you know, there's no aggression going on. You know, you're both uh learning from each other and you're both learning how to be a better chess player and it's a little bit of competitiveness but it's not too bad it's just a relaxed it's it's not physical it's just something that you're just looking and you're just learning you know and psychonesis has to be perceived in that in a way that it's educational and it's uh self-developed uh, um, developmental and it's just like when you sit alone doing math and you're doing equations you know, you just have a piece of paper and a pen, and you're just sitting there writing on a paper. You know, there's nothing going on. But you're but you're learning, and you're developing, and you're thinking. And that's what psychonesis is, is that it requires you to be patient, and to be relaxed, and for you to be, uh, uh, for you to be attentive, and to, and to think, and to feel, and, 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 and basically it's more of a stationary activity. You know, where you learn how to weld, you, you know, you learn how to put together some, some electronics, you know, you learn how to build your first uh, computer and, and, and assemble a motherboard. You're just by yourself in the quietness of your house. You're just there assembling. And that's what psychonesis is. Just you're in the quietness of yourself and you're learning and you're just moving things quietly and subtly and softly. And there's, there's nothing going on. There's no fists flying and kicks a roundhouse is going on and there's no explosions and there's no yelling or screaming it's just all learning and psychonesis we have to perceive it as it is and is that it's you're just learning and a psychonesis is not it's not a physical activity it's a mental activity like learning learning mathematics and and reading and writing and learning a game chess or learning uh, the the Chinese chess games or whatever you know or playing a uh, uh, minesweeper on the computer you're just sitting there by yourself and you're just learning by yourself you know and and it's all just calm and relaxed and it's very peaceful and it's just basically like like uh, like like a kid at school learning you know and that we have to get go uh, step away from the idea that it's it's uh we have to be like you know um i have to learn psychonesis so i can beat everybody up and i could be a powerful uh, be negative and kill kill someone with it and like try to be aggressive and you know be dominant and and, and psychonesis is you know you cannot develop it because once you develop it you start to understand what it requires from you once you get deeper and deeper and you get more better at it you realize that 
you cannot utilize any negative um, aspects to use it for negative intentions because you're develop because only way to develop it is to be in a positive relaxed manner where you're calm and at peace with yourself and you understand yourself and when you're in there there's no it's it's so uh, crazy to think that you know like there's no logical reason for you to be negative and use it for a negative manner and psychonese is just like that you know uh that's the reality of what psychonese is you just sit and you learn you pay attention to the tutorials what you watch on tv and you teach yourself as as you're um also learning from yourself you have to be the teacher and the student like i said and only you will know when you build a connection you have to be patient with yourself and you have to be devoted to what's going on and you will grow but psychonesis we have to get rid of those bad stigmas and those bad bad um, um things that we think of it as we're not going to be like negative goku we're not going to be like like a negative sorcerer flying around killing people whatever it cannot be that way it's not that way the reality is that psychonesis is very similar to learning to play chess learning to read and write writing a book learning to learning to assemble a, a computer with the with the with, with a sorting iron you know learning to assemble um, an electronic little car or to paint a model model toy car or or to um or to uh, do your math work at home it's something that's just a normal thing that you just do you know like a hobby or a craft thing that you do at home it's something like that's relaxing it's something that you do you relax you focus and you develop and you learn that's what psychonesis is and that's how it's going to be for all of us all throughout our lives and that it will never be something that's negative i'm not saying that it's not possible for it to be negative but it should not be and it's going to take a hell of a lot of work for that person to make psychonesis um from learning from making it to, to he knows that person or she knows that what's required of it and then to twist it to make it negative is just going to take a whole lot of damn work for that person a lot of balancing going on emotionally to have kindness and then anger melded together is going to be a huge problematic balance so it is possible but it should not be done and it's just a normal mundane relaxing innate thing that we do at home it's a normal thing but an extraordinary thing all at once and it's very enlightening and that's what psychonese is we have to look at it differently thank you very much Matt Cat Sphere.